morning everyone it's thursday december 7th i am headed to go get my hair done i'm so excited you guys i'm so excited because i haven't had my hair dyed or done or cut or touched up since june which is so long it is december it's so nice having brown hair because i don't have to go every like month and get touch up on my roots like i did with my blonde but i'm so excited actually let me start my makeup and then i'll talk to you guys because i need to like multitask here look at my little bag <laughs> i started to put product in it just to like see how it looks <laughs> so cute look how cute the little cases it reminds me of like a little pencil case when i was in school like i'd put all my pencils in here and like dig around for them i put all my makeup brushes in here i have this thing which i love actually this is on amazon i can link it down below along with this but it's a brush case and it keeps them to where like i'll show you guys you just like set them in here and they all stay like sitting up so i love this because whenever i'm traveling i take the top apart and then i put like my face brushes in this one and my eyeshadow brushes in this one but the problem is is i started carrying too many makeup brushes and when i would put them in this case and i would have to put the top on i was like squishing them and it just wasn't working so i was like i need to get like just a bag to throw them in but i love this thing it's so dirty i think i've had this for probably three years now they have it in black which would be better because i got makeup all over it i don't know what compelled me but it's so cute. <laughs> I loved Hello Kitty as a child. Like, loved. Anyway, if you guys didn't know, Eric moved here to Texas. So, he's done my hair for, like, literally my entire life. And he always does all my hair transformations. And we, we have been going back and forth on what to do. And I would love to go back blonde eventually. But I'm not over the brown right now i don't know why i just i'm really liking it it's just like so easy and i feel like it suits my skin tone really well but then i look at photos with the blonde and i'm like gosh the blonde was so nice but also like what tends to happen is whenever i have any hair color for a while i will always get comments and they'll always be like i know i've always said that this color was your best color but seriously this color suits you so well and with the brown i get like so many comments like that like oh my god the brown is your color like never go back blonde so it makes me question if i even look good as a blonde which is not true because i was blonde majority of my life like this is the only time i've had dark brown hair so yeah it's hard to pick especially when going blonde is like such a process i don't know but today i'm sticking with brown so we're just gonna do a touch up on the brown i think he's gonna add some highlights into my hair because the first time we did a brown we just did like an all over chocolate color like it was just like a super brown color and i also don't have any extensions in right now and i think we're gonna add tapins which i'm so excited about i am so like phony like i don't ever know how to make up my mind <laughs> eric probably like literally wants to fight me but i never know what i want because for so long i'll be like no like i just literally don't want any extensions and you guys know i was like debating on chopping my hair and doing like a blunt bob again because i miss it so much and then here i am getting extensions and i'm so excited to have long hair also tonight we're having a surprise party for my friend sheila it's just a surprise at dinner we've been planning it for a while we were actually supposed to have it last sunday and we did not know but sheila extended her stay home in texas she was out of town and we were <laughs> We thought she was coming home, so we were planning this whole thing. And then we text her, and she's like, oh, I'm in Texas. Why? What's up? And we're like, oh, my God. Not you having a full surprise party, and you're not even in the state of California. <laughs> so we rescheduled, and we were like, oh, let's do a birthday dinner on Thursday, and I'll hang out. Because Sheila's birthday is on the 26th. It's November 26th, so it's always close to Thanksgiving. And so a lot of people, like, aren't ever here to celebrate her birthday so we'd always plan to do a little birthday celebration but she thinks we're just gonna do dinner like just me and her and two other girls and we're just gonna go to john and Vinny's, but that's not the case we're gonna go to our other friend's house and she's making a charcuterie board and we're gonna have like a little movie on the projector and do a little like dinner table vibe and it's gonna be really cute i think she'll be surprised because we've been like making this like john and Vinny's dinner like super casual like oh i think i can do 10 like just making it like super chill 
So I think she'll be surprised. It's hard in friend groups when you all share your location. It's like, how do I surprise you when you literally can see where I am at all times? Anyway, yesterday when I went with Poppy and we got those bagels, I literally took a bite of my bagel. I didn't even realize that my tooth gem fell off and I looked down to grab and take another bite. <laughs> the gem was just sitting on the bagel and I was like, no way, Poppy, this just fell off my tooth. <laughs> Honestly though, I'm not that mad at it because I really wasn't used to having a colorful gem on my tooth. Like I'm so used to having the clear. I still have the bottom one. So I have this one down here, which you can barely see like when I talk. And so I think I'm actually gonna go back next week when I'm back from Texas and I'm gonna do the same thing. Like I'm gonna get a heart in the little one right here, but I'm not gonna do a color. Like since it fell off, I'll just switch it up anyway and just do a regular color. Cause I didn't know how I felt about it. I am so excited to go where Eric's new salon is, like the salon that he's working out of here in California because the area is so cute. It's like right in Huntington. And also it has like one of my favorite restaurants. It's got like this pokey place there and it's so yummy. And so I'm like, oh, I can get pokey. And I just love like being able to catch up with Eric. And it's so cool having him in California now. Like it's just like a piece of home and he's here. I don't know, it feels so weird. Like I'm driving to Eric's salon, but I'm not in Texas. How weird is that? The way I'm holding this contour stick with my pinky up. <laughs> oh my god all right i'm gonna finish my makeup and then i'm gonna get dressed and we're gonna get on the road my hair looks so cute because it's like clean <laughs> and so now i'm like oh my god i'm so excited to go get my hair done okay this is my outfit i'm wearing oh my god let me just drop this um i'm wearing a plain white tee i always wear a white shirt when i get my hair done by eric because i feel like every time we've always done like a fun color i would always just choose a white shirt because i didn't want to choose any color that would clash so i just always stuck with that because i don't know i just like to have like a blank slate and also whenever i felt like i if i do like a black shirt if i wear black and then i have brown hair i feel like the hair just blends into it so i like always pick a white shirt to have something to contrast off of so i'm wearing a plain white tee i'm wearing my heaven mayhem belt i'm wearing baggy white jeans I have my Heaven Mayhem earrings. I don't know if the code still works, but I've got a code, Keaton15, Heaven Mayhem. I'll link some down below. But anyway, um, and then I have this little sweater from Zara. It's always cold whenever I'm getting my hair done. So I typically, ugh, typically just take photos like in the shirt. And then when I'm actually at the salon, ooh, I'll put the sweater on when it's like cold and stuff. But for now, we're just gonna layer it like this and then i'm bringing my tote i'm so excited i have this tote now because i always bring um a lot of stuff to the hair salon because i'm there for so long so let's pack our bag shall we first things first i'm bringing my full makeup bag should i bring my full makeup bag no okay let's not do the whole makeup bag let me give me a second i'm just gonna do the makeup brushes and then all right the only things in here are Concealer, my foundation, cream contour, and bronzer. <laughs> my lip combo for the day, I've got my Limitless Brown and then my Anywhere Caffeine from Makeup Forever, and then my lipstick from Too Faced. I have these glasses. These are so fun. I just feel like they make more of these today. Hand lotion, this is the Le Labo one in the scent hinoki smells so bomb oh i want this road lip this is the salted caramel one yeah this salted caramel one is so yum i'm very into like warm scents right now like cinnamon and like cookie butter and like very sweet scents right now because it's like the holidays i don't know why i just like gravitate towards like a sweeter scent portable charger every single time i never leave my house without this this is just moves from every purse that i have it's the best portable charger it's on amazon travel perfume this is the lita Leda. i don't know how to say this but it smells so good it's like a it's vanilla but it's like a very warm like smokier scent and i love the little travel case that this comes in so i put it in there mini deodorant from native this is the 
candy cane one. And I just started my period today. This is my last Midol, so we're gonna throw that in there. Bag is officially packed. I've got everything I need in here, and then I'm gonna add some perfume on. I'm gonna wear this. This is the By the Fireplace scent. I love this scent, especially for fall and winter. It's just like, it's the best scent ever. So I'm gonna, oh my God, this smells so good. Time to get in the car. Let's go. I'm vlogging you, Eric. <gasps> Say Wait. hi. Hello. We just did all the color. She's stunning, and now he's gonna put extensions in, and it's gonna be gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I already feel better already. Just no more ugly roots. No more ugly roots, we're just living in our basic era. Yeah, no color today, sorry. Here's the final result, you guys. It looks so good. She's beautiful. Did Eric beautiful. not slay? It's gorgeous. She's brunette, it's a little long. But not too long. But not too long. All right, I'm home from my hair appointment. I'm leaving in like two hours for Sheila's surprise party. Destiny is gonna go pick up Sheila at her place. And then she's gonna come over here and pick me up so we can go to dinner. But actually when I get in the car, I'm gonna blindfold her and then we're gonna drive her to our friend's house where we're having a surprise party for her. Anyway, I have some packages. First one being, I have this one that I ordered on Amazon because um, everyone said that it would help with my neck. It's like this. Oh, it's like a lot harder than I thought it would be. But you set it down and then obviously you like lean back on it and you like lay your neck over this part of it and it stretches it out. So I'm gonna start to do that in the mornings because I really feel like I just need to, I don't know, I just feel like I need to do that. I picked out some clothes. In real life, I talk in an accent all the time for no reason. I just like to like switch them up. But whenever I'm on camera, I don't do it because I get embarrassed. But maybe I'll start just like talking in different accents for you guys because that's what I do in real life. Anyway, I got these shoes. These are from Ray the Label. They're so cute. Hold on. I got them because I ordered a dress in this box that I thought the heels would go with. Look at these heels. I need another light in here. Hold on. Did that get any brighter? I don't know. But look at these heels. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with them. I like that they're square toe because... Pro tip, if you have bunions, you should get square toe heels because if you wear heels that are slim in the front, it's your bunion is so prominent. But if you get square toe, it's nice and wide and it fits them in there really good. So I always have to go for like a square toe heel. Oh, this is just a plain little tank top, but I thought it was so cute because I just wanted a simple top like this. It's a black kind of like muscle tee, but it's fitted this with jeans and like even the belt that I have on. I might even wear this tonight with a little sweater, but like a little belt. This is just so cute and simple. It's actually like a really nice quality too. What brand is this? It's Super Down. Oh, Super Down is typically like really um, inexpensive on Revolve, so I'll link it. I might have to insert a photo of how this looks, but it's a little like corset style top but it laces in the front and it's just got these little strappies. <laughs> I think it's so cute. This is the dress that I thought these heels could go with. This is gonna be hard to show because, okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to insert a photo because this is so hard to explain. <laughs> but it's basically like this. The top, oh my God. The top is a huge flower. So it goes like this over my boobs, like that. And then it's, open like it's a crop and then it has the skirt attached here and it also has got like a big rose on it that's why i thought the little rose heels would be so cute with this this is the most perfect color red i don't have a red sweater and the season the color of the season is red i was like i gotta get i gotta get something red this is an extra small oh i'm so glad i didn't get a small because like look at the sleeves on this <gasps> This is so, stop. Literally, this is so cute. And then I got this top, it's a one shoulder top. So it's a little bit tight, it's rouged, it's got like this little floppy thing and then it's long sleeve on one side and then it's just obviously open on the other. I just thought this would be super cute. I need tops like this that are like simple, have no design. I can wear them with jeans and like go out to dinner in them or something. This is my favorite piece out of the whole Revolve order. This is a leather nude trench. Okay, I, <laughs> the way this sounds is not it. Oh 
I am obsessed with this. I don't like that it's so noisy. Like, <laughs> it's pretty noisy, but like, you can see it goes in right here, so it's like a little bit cinched, and then also I could like tie it if I wanted to. This with boots and a little dress underneath it, and then if it's cold, you, know, you can do like a big sweater under here. <gasps> oh, I love it. I think if I was gonna layer like big sweaters or stuff that's really heavy duty, I probably would've gotten a medium, because this fits like perfectly on me, like even the, um, even the arm length is like perfect, but I do think if I like layer under this, become like a little bit snug just because it's like leathery, so it won't like stretch very much. But <gasps> that's everything that I got from Revolve. I just want to give you a really quick haul. I think I'm gonna take a little break. I just drove an hour and a half home. I'm gonna eat some food and sit for a little bit, and then I'm gonna vlog when we go to Sheila's surprise party. Also, look at my hair, you guys. It looks so good. It feels nice to have like simple, clean, fresh hair. Like the color looks so nice. Also, I haven't had extensions in a while, and I think they're really fun. They're not too, too long but also they're like a really good length for my hair, I feel like right now. It looks so good. Destiny's about to pick me up, but I'm gonna open up the advent calendars for today because I don't wanna forget and I'm gonna be too tired when I get back. Here is day seven, French Cade Lavender. Oh yeah. Oh, that smells really good. I do love lavender. Also, these little stickers like easily come off, which is kind of nice because then I just have like a little clear thing. All right, she's almost here. So now we're gonna do day seven in the YSL advent calendar. Day seven, YSL Pure Shots Night Reboot Serum. Oh, that's cute. I just think everything mini is cute, even if it's like something I'll literally never use in my life. I just think it's cute. I just ate like half a jar of cookie butter from Trader Joe's. It's just like sometimes I'll convince myself, you know, like you can take one spoonful and be good, like get your sugar fix in. One is never enough. Like then I just keep on going and I just could not stop myself just now. Hey, happy Vlogmas happy and happy birthday. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is what you guys are listening to. We're only running like 25 minutes late. It's fine. I it's fine. She called. She hey, called. So we're not going to go to Stone and Benny's. <laughs> we got to get food in. But we're getting food. We are getting food. You're going to oh, eat. Gonna you're going to eat, but you're not going <laughs> to eat at John and Benny's. Okay. Destiny almost just killed you, so I'm really glad you made it to this age. Um, okay, so I am gonna blindfold you with okay, this scarf. Don't scarf her. But we have a long drive, so okay, okay. not a long Let's drive. Start. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna put it on when we're like 10 minutes away. That okay. way you don't really know what is good. Okay. okay. But you will be scarfed. <laughs> you will. And why she are was we like, tonight? She was, was like, like so we're 25 minutes late for the reservation. I'm like. Oh yeah, there's literally no reservation happening. We ne we ain't never making that, <laughs> bro. They're gonna. Someone texted me three days ago from John Vinny's and was like, "Are you still good?" And I'm like, "Confirm." Yeah, we couldn't really yeah. like nix so, your as, plans. As much as like, no, that, that does check so out. Good. That, that does check out. Oh. Cancel reservation. There's a. Yep. Keep going. <laughs> yeah, just look down. <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna close the door. Here we go. Um, I need Destiny, hold on, because I actually don't know exactly. <laughs> Guys, we better not be crossing LH LH. We're oh, kind of. It's the sounds of the chorus for me. Cute scarf, I'm glad I brought it. I know. I was like, wait, it's actually chilly. Okay, we're well, almost there, just like a little bit more. Just keep looking down, you know. I'm like clinging on to you for protection. I, I don't have one clue where we could be. We what? That's what all of the circles <laughs> were. We just has just been driving in three sticks. We just took you to hide. And now we're, we're literally stop. just walking into John and Vinny's now. <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> Guys, thank you! Home, a cozy fire. 